Station, this is Houston ACR. That concludes questions from the Canadian Space Agency. Please stand by for a voice check from the European Space Agency, PAO. Um, hello, this is Jean-Claude speaking from the European Astronaut Center. Uh, do you hear me? Stay hello, this is Jean-Claude. Space Station is reading you loud and clear. Hello, Frank. Uh, this is the first question. About the van Spielbeek, uh, Belgian Spielbeek, Belgian TV, VTF. Good morning, Frank. Frank. Thank uh, Baudouin. Hello, Baudouin. The ISS has grown quite a bit throughout the years. And you are living there with six people now. What has changed since your last day there in 2002? Well, quite a bit has changed, of course. In the first place, ISS has become much larger. We have a large laboratory space added, European laboratory, Columbus, but also the laboratory from JAXA has been added. There's a lot more scientific equipment on board from the International Space Station. And of course, there's also six people here now which means that we will be able to work much more efficiently with my colleagues, Bob Roman and I. We started the first days already to adjust to the schedule of the three people that were here already as best as possible and as fast as possible. Gone and how is it going over there? These first days have uh, gone on very well. Actually, we were very happy that it was the weekend, Saturday and Sunday, so we had some tasks that uh, were not uh, major. We didn't have too many things to do over the weekend. We started working right now, as we co will continue to do during the rest of the six months. But we have two more days. We had two days to organize each other and to feel comfortable, and it felt very good, actually. Frank, good morning. This is RTL. You were very impatient to look at what you could see from space. And what are also your other um, activities that you'd like to do in your spare time? Well, certainly, yes, we have looked at Earth from Soyuz, and we tried to look outside to be able to look at Earth. And for the last two days, we have looked a lot, and we have very nice windows to look at Earth. We have flown over it several times. We've flown over Belgium, and I've looked at it with a lot of pleasure, of course. And for other activities during our spare time, we try to stay in touch with our family, which is the most important, and also we enjoy some music sometimes. Hello, Frank. Kathleen Everhart for VRT News. How is the adjustment to lack of gravity? Did it make you nauseous the first days? Uh, the, is, uh, the adjustment went very well. In general, when it's the second time you fly, your body will adjust faster. So it didn't bother me that much, and especially here in the space station. From the first moment on, we felt very well, and we have been welcomed very well by our colleagues, and were able to find our bunk beds right away. So the adjustment went very well. Hello, this is Dirk Wagner from uh, German Radio Hessischer Rundfunk. Question also for Frank de Winne. Um, I know you all work as a team together in space, but what exactly will change when you will take over command of the ISS in October? What will change for your duties on board the station? Thank you. 
Uh, my duties will not change uh, very much. Uh, uh, I will probably uh, st st stand in the center like uh, Gennady is now standing in the center for the press conferences, and that will be the biggest difference, I think. Uh, for the rest, uh, Gennady is an excellent commander, and uh, for the first four months, I will uh, learn a lot from him, look how he's doing, and then I will uh, continue in exactly the same way. RT Radio News, were you also able to adjust well at life there in the ISS, especially concerning sleeping and how are your fitness exercises going? Sleeping is going very well. We were lucky uh, with the time schedule of the launch that didn't require too many, too much of an adjustment between the moment of the launch and the daily routine here on board of the space station. As far as uh, physical tra training is concerned, that's not going to start that until middle of this week. First week, we have to adjust to zero gravity. I did have a few sessions with the colleagues that were already on board to see how they do the exercises and also have to learn to see how they do the exercises. Hello, Frank. Vis Gijsens for uh, last news newspaper. What uh, did you eat and drink the first days on, sp um, on board of this space station? Eating and drinking standard food. That is up here. We have uh, also delicious Russian food, also Japanese, American food. So we just eat what is served on the table, as they say in Flemish. And usually, like today for uh, lunch, we went in the Russian segment. Kanadi prepares all kinds of stuff, and uh, we just eat what all of us, we eat what he made.